All right, here we go. So Sexy Red, she found herself at odds with former NFL wide receiver Antonio Brown. At this point, no one even knows if AB runs his own Twitter account anymore. That said, he was wilding out with a meme about Sexy smelling bad. This was posted in response to a viral video that was making the, the rounds of Sexy Red vibing to some music in her car. Sexy came through with a clapback of her own as she posted the photo of what CTE in the brain looks like. This was followed up by drawing a disabled person trying to fit a block in the wrong hole. Oh, that's, that's, <laughs> that's fucking She's lady. hilarious. That's fucked up. <laughs> yeah, but I mean... I mean, you, that's, it's not funny, but that's funny. It's funny. It's funny, it's funny, funny. That I, is funny. How he know she stink? So, ooh, and CTSPN is the perfect podcast name. I, I really hope he starts that. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> she called him special. I mean, he is special. Yeah. They were telling her that she needs to Hey, so Michael. Flip this song. Flip this song. Flip this song. Sean Michaels had the best finishing move. Hell yeah, that's my dude. Yeah. Sweet chin music. Uh, sweet chin music. It was over. No. No. I don't know. She's actually listen, yo, like, uh, like, uh, she's actually like somebody where, bro, bro, she just fits like internet culture just perfect. Yo, okay. like she, like she, like she just has her hand, like what she's doing and on Twitter. Uh -huh. Is what like these huge companies like mm -hmm. pay people like to do for like she's an influencer. No, like yes, but like the Wendy's Twitter type of thing. Yeah. Yeah, right. Like like it's like most rappers are are like influencers or even like like us, you know, and like who make content for a living, we dream to be as witty, as improvising, as mm -hmm. funny, as sexy red and on Twitter. Like 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 I'm wondering, do somebody run her Twitter for her? Like, like is there like like a team of people that like she, 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 like she's hiring to like, you know, like to do this? Because she's just she's really great at it. I think yeah. she's just authentic. Yeah, I she, think she's just be herself. Yeah, and, and unapologetic. In a lot of cases, that works when you just be yourself. Yeah. Not all cases, but in most cases, it works when you're just yourself. Yeah. No, that the but she has top notch humor and like, and on her Twitter, like past like a past like past like Antonio Brown. If you just go down in her Twitter, mm -hmm. it's her just like memes. It's just like she's like she runs like a meme account slash rap account slash like it's crazy. So you know Twitter, crazy? Twitter is helping Sexy Red's career, but it's hurting artists like Meek Mill. And I feel like Nicki Minaj's career. Right? I feel yeah, like it right. hurts their career when That's they get on Twitter on that bullshit and yeah. people not like them. That's why but it can... works for Sexy Red. So yeah, it works work different. That's why you can tell it's down, organic. You, know? yeah. you can tell it's organic with, with Sexy Red. Twitter is um Twitter is a very negative place, but it is also it can be very funny. If yeah. you set off the right tweet, it you're can, like, good it at can it. lift people day. Seeing something funny on Twitter. No, like if you're good at it, mm -hmm. then as an artist, it's gonna work for you. But if you're like somebody like Meek Mill who don't understand, bro, like you can't beat the internet, mm -hmm. then it's not gonna work for you. Listen, I have to admit it, man. I was not feeling her when she first came out, man. But she has officially won me over, bro. I am, I am part of the sexy red beehive. Bro. Now, so just me, a week. Where? Where? Four minutes around she three. has won me over, bro. Listen, you can't say shit bad about sexy red in front but, of me. No all more, right, man. well then, uh, I remember maybe like a week or so ago we had a conversation. You said that sexy red wasn't a superstar. No, not yet. No, she's a superstar. Yes, right. They uh, wasn't letting her uh, stop. You a week ago. When I was huh? in the press bin, they yeah. wasn't yeah, of her stop yeah, to talk yeah, to Oh, no, they, they told us no. They moved her on. Like, they no, told us, they told the us no, on literally. Sunday, yeah. and she, she was coming back, I think, to do Chief Keef's set, I believe. Okay, this So she came back through the press pit. I was like, hey, Red. Like, yeah. security had her swarmed on me. No, we asked for an interview with her, and um, we asked her directly, because she was standing right next to us. Mm. And her security said, we already told y'all no. It's not going to happen. And then took her, snatched her away. So, yeah, she wasn't fucking with us. Mm. Well, like she, like well, like she hit us. Well, uh, and she told us via an IG DMs that she would do one, mm. and just to hit her team. No, listen, right when we yeah. asked her, she, I could tell when somebody's about to say yes, like you can tell by their facial expression. Mm -hmm. She was about to say yeah and do it, but her security said or whoever that her handler, let me say that her handler was like nah. So like we already crazy. told y'all no. I don't remember him telling us no, but okay. Man, nah, man, but yeah, listen. So when I say. 
I don't think she's a superstar yet. I'm talking about when I say superstar, you have to be in the top five, top three range as superstar. No, that's a megastar. What you're referring to as a megastar. I know she's not a megastar. She's definitely a superstar. You said no, she read no. Ice Spice. No, a superstar is just someone with that level of, she's a of star. fame. Like in, when they go she anywhere, people Spice? recognize them. I think so. Right now, now, me personally. No. Uh, I, think, she, I think she used to. No. I think she's a superstar. I think she's bigger than Ice Spice. Let's sure. be clear, though. She's hotter than Ice Spice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. Again, at, at this point, yeah. at where, where it stands right now. Especially coming from the streets. It's like, yeah, yeah. 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 Coming from the streets. Let's yeah. be clear, though. And Ice Spice had two number one songs in the last 12 what months. Should, well, okay, watch this. And this is one of my favorite music conversations. And number two songs. You're right having an Uptown versus LaFace conversation. Sharp, you're a little older, so you'll get this analogy I'm about to make. People like Tony Braxton. People like Boys the Men. That was LaFace, and they would sell seven, eight, nine, ten million records. People love Jodeci. People love Mary J. Blige. And they would only sell about two, three million. You get what I'm saying? They had less commercial success, but they had the streets. Yeah. You feel me? They had the hood. She's hotter probably that, in the yeah, hood. Gave them the right, yeah. Too. yeah. In yeah, the hood probably, last, but yeah. no, no, facts yeah. but, but though, what she said is yeah. she bigger than Ice Spice. I'm referring to like the grand conversation of who is bigger? Who's more right? Right, like and I ain't not Ice Spice, but I don't right now it's Ice Spice right now, bro. Swift. She damn sure not a better I performer. Don't, I don't care if she was kicking no. it with Taylor Swift. Like that mm. doesn't matter to me, and I feel mm. like that's what people hold like a candle. Well, who the, the Dunkin' Donuts, Ben, uh, Ben Affleck, yeah, Ben, ben Affleck, Affleck. Uh, commercials. But that's what I'm saying. That's the two pop, Billboard that's number the one pop, songs. That's the pop aspect of it. But yeah. Sexy Red has the culture, and right. the culture is right. now pop culture. Correct. Right, the moon though. Right. But so, she's still not yeah. a bigger name than Ice Spice in 2024 at this particular time. I think she's, she's more relevant. I, no. I think she's more relevant. She, she's more influential. Right. right. If they I both drop, the if they said, both right drop now, tickets. Where it, where it right. Start, right, right now, where yeah. it stands. Yeah, yeah. she's not bigger. I feel, like, I feel like Sexy Red is yeah. bigger at this point. If they both announce concert tickets right now mm -hmm. in LA or wherever. Sexy Red's tickets are going to sell faster. They're going to sell faster. Nice spice. I, People would rather I buy a ticket to Sexy Red because it's not yes. videos of terrible Sexy Red performances yeah. all over the fucking internet. Like if they do a spice. tour, listen, if they do a tour, uh, I believe that Ice Spice would, would, would sell more tickets. It's their tour. What are you talking about? I don't about? think so. No, 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 you you no, talking no. about who's going to perform first? No, 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 no. Sorry. Yeah. Oh, if the they both tour. did a tour. If they tour. both did a tour. Uh, Bro, without an industry button, I would say Sexy Red. Organically, I would say I Sexy would say Red. Too, with really an industry right. button being pushed, Ice Spice possibly. Who's open? Who else is performing? No. I think that's that's going to be a determining mm -hmm. factor as well. It's just them. Yeah. Uh, I think Sexy Red's No, yo. Yeah. Yo, what's crazy, right? Yo, we're yeah. in such a bad spot, I guess, in music-wise, right? Uh -huh. That somebody can drop, for example, right, right? I think the song with uh the like Boys are Liars. Oh, that's, like, that's a banger, Boys are Liars. Two, right? Part two, right? I like that like, song. Like, 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 like a peak, like top 15, I think. Uh -huh. And she had the two number one songs and then plus the Taylor Swift. Yes. So like she did all that in 12 months and took like like uh, like about like a solid like like a four months off. Uh-huh. And we are and we forgot about like I said, because damn, it's like, the quality. There's no quality control there. Her music, uh, again, the Boys Liar record is a bop, and the Delhi record is a bop. But there's no quality. There's not much to Ice Spice other than how she looks. And then when you see her on stage, we didn't review her performances at least five, ten times. Yeah, at show. least every time she goes on stage, it go viral for being bad. Yeah, it never it's viral for good. Yeah, it's horrible. So it's like she has no stage presence. She has no interest in being a lyricist. She has no interest in competing. She's not trying to drop no classic body of work. At least Sexy Red has the streets and has that organic. And she has a personality, too. Yeah, versus um, yeah. Ice yo, Spice. Yo, I definitely, your, I'm um, definitely picking Sexy Red now, over Ice Spice. I'll say this. I feel like, okay, yeah, Ice Spice has a little bit more sex appeal. You know what I'm saying? But okay. oh, she's, oh. yeah, she's got a little bit, and just respectfully, yeah. like she's yeah. got a little bit more sex appeal than Sexy Red. But when yeah. it comes to like actually, if they drop ticket sales today, like uh, just put tickets on sexy sale. Red. Sexy Red by a long shot. What the chat saying? So Sexy Red's at 57% and Ice Spice is at 43%. Who is hotter right now? Uh, yeah. we, going with, we going with Sexy Red, Flacco? No, where's the right? No, sure. Yeah, it's pretty close. With the with the right, no, no it's a landslide. Mm -hmm. No, with this pull right here, we're kind of like proves right why like we got to take these things with a grain of salt, right? Because again, like one artist is the bigger artist just in general, right? In terms of like like success, the numbers, the everything. Yeah, they're the bigger artists, and then the other artists 
you know, I guess, you know, is more coarsely relevant. You feel me? Right? Right? Like, like for example, Poundtown, right? Like, like Poundtown Part 2 peaked at number 65. The first Poundtown song never made Billboard. But that's still a really big song in the quote-unquote culture. So, Sexy Red is on Gamma Records, and then Ice Spice is on uh, Capitol Records. Mm. All right. So, Flocka, would you yeah. say, okay, maybe Ice Spice is at a higher point, yes. but who has the most energy, momentum? Who's in a better spot right now? Because don't you think that Sexy Red's like on this meteoric rise? She also just had a kid. Sure. So she had to like take like a month off here, like in the middle of this month and a half off, which is still a crazy short amount of time after just having a kid. Sure. No, mm -hmm. listen, like she's rising, but we have yet oh. to see that top 10 oh. banger. She has arrived. You feel me? We have like even like 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 the ski and the pound town, like those are those are culturally relevant records, but oh. but those records ain't really like crossover. That, that, and, and got but like top they have yet. way more. I'm yeah. not gonna say like substance, but just way more meaning to what, the records? culture yeah. than the Munch record. Right. You get what sure. I'm saying? She I has more like. meaning to the to the culture. Yeah. Look, who 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 in the fuck else has a baby? Drops the baby, uh -huh. makes it a positive, and then drops a song called Party "Fuck B? My Baby Daddy," and oh, she oh, is okay. dancing in the hospital. Mm, how? Had a baby. And now she's at Rolling Loud. Yeah, she, she performed on tour pregnant. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Hard to be like, had it. Had it. That would slow down a lot of, a, a privacy, a lot right? of artists. Like, like, after having a kid. I ain't right? gonna lie. I, like, I, I don't even like her music. I just think she's a cute bitch. I think that's why a lot of people that's even it. show up to even, like, no, it's just a look. Baby girl. It's just look. She just got a look to her, man. It's nothing and people else. fuck with that. She let, them little, she let them little brown little cheeks out, little light skinned cheeks, and people go crazy for it. That's it. Verse sex and red is really you something. You close your eyes and, like, don't look at Ice Spice. You close your eyes and just listen to the music. Right. Garbo. Well, you would just have to mute Not the music Deli video and just watch the Deli record Garbo, and yeah. the boys. She has one or two records that are cool.